Hey, I'm Cameron McKenzie at CameronMCNZ on Twitter, and I wanted to talk to you about empty directories and Git, and specifically how you can push an empty directory to other Git repos, be it GitHub or GitLab, and I'm gonna do it with a Git keep file. So Git won't push empty folders up to GitHub or share them for that matter to any other directory, and I could show you that simply by copying this git url for the github made easy project that i've got here up on github i got a temp folder here and i'm going to clone that repository so i'll do a little git bash say hey git i want you to clone that repo paste it in and then you can see very quickly this repo is cloned there's the new file there's the readme the same as these right here and i can move into that directory do a little ls and then you can see those files right there. Now watch what happens if I, you know, touch a hello.html file and then also make a new directory. So I've touched that file. So I just created a basic hello.html file and I also created a new directory here. I'm gonna do the git add and then I'm gonna do a git commit. And then I'm going to do the old git push to origin. And just allow me to put my username and password in here. And now watch what happens. Everything gets pushed up, but some things don't get pushed up. So if I do a refresh over here, you can see hello was pushed. I created that file just to prove that things were being pushed up but that new directory is not pushed up. And the rule is Git will not push empty directories. So let me move into that folder, new directory. There's nothing in it, but I can do a little touch. Then you can just create this file any way that you want and say touch git keep. And if I go into this folder here, you'll notice there's a file named git keep. This isn't a git specific file. This is kind of evolved from the community as a convention, uh, but there's nothing specific about this. Uh, however, the rule with git is, it, is that any folder that has a resource in it will get pushed to other git repositories. So if I now do a git commit, or do a git add, gotta do the right commands, then do a git commit, and then do a git push to origin, put in my password, then all of a sudden, that folder will get pushed. And so I've got the new directory here, I've got the git keep right there, and if I come over to GitHub, do a quick refresh, all of a sudden I've got the new directory and I've got the dot keep in there. And so there you go. That's how you can use git keep to make sure that your new folders, empty folders, get pushed to other git, GitHub, or GitLab repos. And there you go. That's how easy it is to push empty git directories to GitHub or GitLab or Bitbucket or even just another basic git repo. Now, if you enjoyed that tutorial, why don't you head over to the serverside.com. I'm the editor in chief over there. Got lots of great tutorials on Git, GitHub, and anything to do with enterprise software development, really. If you're interested in my personal antics, you can follow me on Twitter at CameronMCNZ and subscribe on YouTube.